we're going to do an unboxing. That we just arrived. That's just arrived, and it's a pretty big box. Whoa! Oh, heavy. Bigger than the last one. Heavier than yeah. It's a heavy box, and what we're going to do? Cut it open with our trusty scissors. Thanks, Declan. These are your trusty scissors. Yeah. Okay. Uh, and I'm going to be here this now time. I'm... I hopefully won't cut my finger. And now everyone knows my oh! name. Oh! What's in there? Oh my gosh. Look at that. Can you see it? Oh my god. What is it, Declan? A hot dog maker. A hot dog maker? How does that even work? Well, let's have a look. So we get this box out of the way. Ah. And let's open this other box. Yeah. It's come from Global Gourmet and it says on there with heated stainless steel rollers and adjustable timer. Oh gosh. Well, today's New Year's Eve, and what do you want for dinner tonight, Declan? Hot dogs. Hot dogs. Well, look at this. I think we've got an instruction book, Global Gourmet, and it has five pages of stuff. And inside we've got some, oh, I think we're gonna have to tip it out like this. Yeah. Pop the box over there. It comes with some styrofoam, chuck that over there. Big plastic wrap. And it's pretty cool. It is way cool. The unboxing of unboxing. Yep, that's right, lots of unboxing. As you can see, it comes with a couple of trays, which are for the little oven rack thing down here, I think. Oh, what? what's this? Well, it's the same instruction book. Are you having a look inside? Yep. You've got this, and up here, Declan, can you see? Have a video over it. There's like some rollers and you put your sausages on there and inside we've got these little pans. It's just like little tiny baking trays. Hang on, does that fit? How does that fit? Doesn't fit that way. I think that's how it goes. Yay! Little way. Oh hang on. Hang on, what's that? It fits that way. Yeah. I'm not sure it does. I don't think it fits. Anyway, we shall investigate how these things fit at some point. Maybe that's it, I don't know. But we'll, we'll leave the instruction book. But I think this is pretty cool. And tonight, we'll, we're will we gonna have a sausage party. Oh, look, there's a better one. There we go. Tonight, we're gonna have a sausage party. And we're gonna see, oh, does that fit up there? I'm not sure. And we're gonna see how this works. So there Maybe you go. Maybe there's one for the buns and one for the sausages. Yeah, well, we'll, 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 have, we'll definitely have a look at the um, instruction book and we'll work it out. Test is the Global Gourmet Hot Dog Maker and uh, we're going to give it a go. We've plugged it in, it's a bit precarious looking. What we have to do, flip the on switch. We've already prepared by putting in the hot dogs, oh sorry the hot dog buns. Flip the switch, I don't know what happens next. What I might do is just stop. So we'll have a little look here and it's got a dial and I'm not even sure what that's all about there's nothing in the instructions that says what to do either Hang on a sec. oh it's a timer okay well, that's good well I've got the buns in I'm not even sure how this works but I'm going to see if we can fit the sausages in. Actually, you see if you can put a couple in. Right, so two. Okay. And I guess we close the lid. I don't know how this even works. I think this shows how long you cook it. Yeah, I know. But, oh, hang on. I don't even know. 30 minutes is in What? 30 minutes? Can you read that? Yeah. Okay, well I don't think we'll be going for 30 minutes. Are these rotating? They are, look! Oh, look. that is cool. Yay! Don't touch them! Get your fingers off the sausages. Wow. So, so what we're going to do is we're going to watch this and we'll come back and, yeah, show you what happens. I'm not terribly sure how good this would be if you're, um, 
preparing a, a massive meal or something, which we generally are. But in terms of, you know, maybe like party, perhaps, and get everyone to do their own thing. Probably be quite handy if you were at, if you were at like, if you had a hotel and just for fun or yeah like I said a party everyone can just make their own hot dogs or just replace them as they go I have no idea really but it's quite fascinating watching these little sausages go around when you're using sausages you've got to defrost them thoroughly I hope they're defrosted enough they're not quite we'll see I have a sneaking suspicion I might have to put the rest in the oven oh what's that smell let's have a look at the bread Mmm, maybe it's toasty. Is it toasted? I'm not even sure. It's not feeling particularly warm or anything. So I don't know. Um, it's flashing a bit on the video, but there's a blue light and a red light. And apparently the red light goes on and off depending on how hot it is and so on. So we shall see. The sausages have actually changed colour. Hurrah! So it does mean they're actually cooking. Can you see this video? What I'm doing is I'm going to do this for Declan because it was his idea to have a sausage party for New Year's Eve. And you want two sausages? No, one. One? You sure? Yeah. Are you sure? You are normally a sausage beast. Do you want two? Two, yeah. Do you want two buns? Yeah. Okay, it's a little bit tinged over on this side. No, that's fine. We didn't get any mustard or anything, did we? No. Oh, what's going on with the bread? But we do here? have ketchup. All right, well, I'll put some ketchup on for you. So there you go. Yep. So I'll open it up. It's like real hot dogs without the mustard. Yep. No, it doesn't like the mustard. Okay, so. Bon appétit. What does the waiter skeleton say to the server? What? Bon appétit. Ah, okay. How's that? Excellent. What's your opinion of the sausage maker? Very good.